Welcome to Zarin Tech this presentation on Workday's business process framework. I'll be walking you through the key concepts and capabilities of Workday's configurable business processes. Let's start with a quick disclaimer. The materials in this video are provided for informational purposes only. It's your responsibility to comply with copyright laws. No part of this document may be reproduced without permission, except for fair use. Images from open sources are used for illustration only and cannot be used for promotional purposes without consent. We will cover the following topics in this video. Overview. Configurable BPs. Business process definitions. Order of execution. Configure rule-based business process. Business process notification. Let's start with an overview of business processes in Workday. The image shows an overview of business processes in Workday. The business process framework provides the ability to define and implement business processes to match your company's specific policies and procedures. You can choose the tasks that make up a process and the order they must be completed. Custom business processes can be defined for any supervisory organization. The process logic is inherited, so subordinate organizations automatically use a process defined for a parent organization, unless they have their own version. Some common actions that are available on workday business processes include, fix, put on hold, open, submit, save for later, reassign, review, revise, skip, to do, approve, cancel, close, correct, deny, don't accept. These provide flexibility in how steps can be handled as a process moves through its workflow. Here are some examples of commonly used configurable business processes in Workday. For staffing, create position, create job requisition, contract contingent worker, and contingent worker contract, transfer contingent worker, edit hiring restrictions, and positions, hire, terminate, change job. For compensation, request one-time payment, request stock grant, request compensation change, propose compensation for hire. For benefits events, change benefits, change benefits for open enrollment, change retirement savings, change benefits for life events. For time off and leave requests, request time off, request leave of absence, correct time off, request return from leave of absence. For personal data events, date of birth correction, edit ID information, personal information change, marital status change. Now let's look at how business process definitions work in Workday. Business process definitions consist of the list of steps, or tasks, that make up the process workflow. They also define the roles responsible for completing each step. Users can start processes, perform actions within a process, take actions on the whole process like approve or cancel it, reassign tasks, and correct steps. All of this is controlled by the user's security access. Now let's look at how configure rule-based business process in Workday. Configuring rule-based business processes in Workday provides the ability to select different process definitions based on conditional rules. With rule-based configuration, you create a hierarchy of if-then condition rules that determine which process definition Workday selects at runtime. Evaluation stops when the first rule is satisfied. Here are the steps to set up rule-based business process configuration. From the related actions of a process or process type, select rule-based business process configuration. Enter an effective date, defaults to today's date. Optionally enter a time zone if enabled on your tenant. This determines when the rules become effective. Select a rule-based process definition for each condition rule you create. Add additional condition rules and process definitions as needed. Only one condition rule can be assigned per definition. When a process starts, Workday evaluates the rules in order. If a condition rule is satisfied, that process definition is used. If not, it continues checking the next rule. If no rule is satisfied, the default process definition for that organization is used. This provides very flexible configuration options for business processes. Thank you for your time. Please subscribe our channel to get more informative videos on Workday.